Animals are divided into many groups. The second unit of graded science is animal classification. Grouping animals in a systematic way by considering their common features is known as animal classification. Animals are divided into two groups named vertebrates and invertebrates. Vertebrates are animals which have backbone and invertebrates are animals which do not have backbone. Vertebrates are further divided into five groups named pieces. Pieces are mostly fish. Then amphibia. Amphibia live in water as well as land but water is an essential need for their living. Reptilia. Reptilia is animal which live in water as well as land, but water isn't an essential need for reptilia. Aves. Aves is a group which includes more birds. And mammalia. Mammalia is a group which we belong to. Next, let's see about invertebrates. Invertebrates are further divided into four groups named Cnidaria, Annelida, which are worm form, Mollusca, which are soft bodied animals, and Arthropoda, which have jointed appendages. Today, let's see about invertebrates. Invertebrate group is Cnidaria. Jellyfish, Hydra, and Sea Animian are some of the examples for Cnidaria. Let's see the features of Cnidaria. They are radially symmetrical. The body can be divided into two halves, two equal halves in many. Axis. There are two forms as polyps and medusa. Polyps are stuck in one place and lead a sedentary life. For example, sea anemian and medusa are free floating organisms. For example, jellyfish. They cook the small creatures for their food with their special tentacles having nidocytes. Do you know? Seawas box jellyfish is the most deadliest jellyfish in the world and the whole planet. It is also known as the marine stinger. Only a 10 year old girl has become the first person ever to have survived an attack from this creature. Annelida Creatures such as earthworm, nevis, and leech are some of the examples of annelida. What are the common features of annelids? They are bilaterally symmetrical. Their body can be divided into two halves. They are vermiform. Their body is divided into segments, so they are known as segmented worms. Do you know, leeches have 32 brains. The giant Dracula leech are intelligent creatures and very lively and fun to maintain and look after. They have a mind of their own and personality as well. Mollusca Mollusca means soft-bodied animals like snails, octopus and slugs. Let's discuss about features of mollusks. They are bilaterally symmetrical. They are soft-bodied animals. They possess a muscular foot. When we closely observe a snail, when we see them, we can see their muscular foot. The skin is moistened with mucus and some wear shells and some do not. Do 
you know the giant Pacific octopus has three hearts, nine brains and blue blood. This is the creature having the most number of hearts. The last group of invertebrates Arthropoda Butterflies Crab Beetle Spider Scorpions as well as ants are examples of Arthropoda. Features of Arthropoda They are bilaterally symmetrical they possess an exoskeleton. Some possess wings. They have extremely segmented body. And all have jointed appendages. Do you know? The success of the arthropods can mainly be attributed to the presence of exoskeleton. Arthropoda is the group to which the highest number of animals belongs. Please like, share and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching.